if I ever showed it um, on the truck, but I had it in the truck for a little bit. But I had a clamshell rooftop tent from uh, Area BFE. And that thing was awesome. It can mount stuff on it and everything. Um, but it was super heavy and it became kind of a pain um, to mount stuff on top of it. And it also made a lot of wind noise and it reduced my gas mileage, all this stuff. So I was super over it at that point. And I also don't like being top heavy. When you're doing off-roading, the last thing you want to feel is like, oh man, I'm gonna tip. So I decided to get rid of it, sold it. And I started looking around for like a different kind of solution where I could sleep in the back. This is a five foot bed. So obviously I couldn't fit in there. Um, but if you drop the tailgate, you get an additional, um, I think two and a half feet. So that's plenty of room. And so what I ended up finding was this brand called Topper Easy Lift. And what it does is it Velcro to the top. I had to install some carpet, you can see. But I installed carpet right here and you Velcro it, this part, that's always up there. And then I have these uh, front runner boxes over here. And that has the bottom of the tent. And so the bottom of it Velcros down here all the way around. And then it comes together, I'll show you guys that. And that's how you sleep. And what's really cool about that is that I'm able to just continue using just my topper. Don't have to worry about the top of it. I can stack a bunch of cargo up here in my box, which is amazing. And it's really great for my solo nights or if it's just me and my fiance Molly. Um, the dogs, however, if the dogs are with us and it's me and Molly and the dogs, we're gonna be doing a ground sleeping situation in the gazelle. But for like road trips or stuff like this, like last minute stuff, this is great. So yeah, I'll show you guys what it looks like. I'm gonna set it up, do a little time lapse. And uh, you'll see it takes about, I'd say about five minutes to set up, not anything crazy. And it is great in like terrible weather. Um, if it's really windy, it's really, it really holds up because it's only just a little bit of a tent here. And uh, the rest of it's all covered with this door. So yeah, I get plenty of air, it's, it's awesome. So I'm going to set it up now. One thing to note, you wanna make sure if you have drawers, you get everything out that you need because they will not be able to open. And also that if you have a table, which I don't know, that's not very common, but if you have a table, get the table out as well. So I'm gonna get everything out that I can possibly need from here and then set up a tent. Done. All right, so here's camp. This is it finished and set up. This is what it looks like. See, I get to use all this space. Um, so yeah, so the inside, I have three windows. This one, this guy here, and the other one over there. Um, this is my sleeping area. You can see it's pretty long, super comfortable. Um, that's gonna be for copper. I think I'm gonna put Laz in the cab. I'm gonna have window access, so he's pretty much right next to me anyway. Just that way we can be comfortable. I know copper will whine, Laz is pretty chill. He is a big baby. Um, yeah, I use this bungee cord around the handle to keep this up a little bit more because it likes to droop. And see, I have this little stool I use. I've got it on Amazon. Um, gotta get a better, more level, but this is perfect to get in there comfortably without having to jump up in there. Um, and here's how it works. You just open it here. I used my front runner box to uh, level it out. It actually happens to be perfect. The same exact height, which is awesome. So I don't know if I did that on purpose. I'm pretty sure I did that on accident. But yeah, that works out perfectly to give me something to rest my feet on. You can see Copper's gonna sleep right there. And then, so what happens is I step up here, and then this helps my knee from hurting on the very painful, uncomfortable um, tailgate. And then, yeah, come in here. And that's it. We're sleeping. And I have Look at this guy. He really wants to come to bed. I have a cool little mount that actually uses the same um, 
Joby tripod. It's magnetic and I can watch TV with it right here like this. Um, so that's gonna be sweet. But yeah, that's uh, the tent. Then to get out, I'm just gonna do, sit down on my butt. It's a little crowded, but I think I need to level the truck out a little bit. It's a little bit this way. So I'm gonna level the truck out and put some rocks on that side. But other than that, it's ready to go. And here's camp. There's one other camper way over there in one of these cool adventure vans. Yeah, I'm gonna set up a fire here and make dinner. And that's gonna be, move, oh my gosh. That's gonna be my view for dinner, which is awesome. And take a lot of pictures out here. I wanna just take a bunch of pictures. Um, yeah, you can see I'm in shorts right now. It's pretty comfortable. I'm pretty sure it's going to get really cold here tonight. It's supposed to get down to 30s, uh, maybe even the 20s, the high 20s. So that's why I got like a bunch of uh, blankets and a 20 degree bag and all kinds of stuff. But yeah, that's it. Um, let me level this truck out before it gets dark and I'll start cooking here in a little bit. And yeah, just enjoy the night. It's going to get dark at 620. So I'll be about an hour before the sun goes down. Alrighty, time for bed. Crap this one. Just a bit. Oh my gosh, look at all the hair. Get on your bed, dude. Hey, get over here. Lay on your spot. Jeez, this dog. Okay. In bed, it is cozy in here. The window's cracked. I can pet Laz right here. Good boy. Pretty nice. This guy has to be with me, or else he'll be annoying. Laz is much easier. You can tell this guy has got some issues. <laughs> All right, anyway. Let me show you how we do movie night. This Joby mount is amazing. Um, it's magnetic and it also has this cool little foam mount, dedicated foam mount that I just swap out between what you're looking at now. There's a mount for the uh, Osmo and for this. I'll show you in a second. All right, so this is what it looks like. This is the setup. It just stays there. And I'll turn the light off. Look at that. By the way, this show is uh, this is a show called Countdown. Um, inspirational mission. It's uh, I think Elon Musk had a rocket and he's getting all these people to join it. And so they're selecting people right now. And it's actually pretty interesting if y'all haven't seen this. So, here we go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.